Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 3. Well, I ended last episode here with a naked woman under this pyramid. I don't know why she's here, but she's here. But we can't do anything about it right now. But Momo is going to read up about, you know, some education. And he's learned some stuff about that, so everything is all good. So let's get out of here for now. Back to the, the wind and the, you know, all this good stuff. But we actually want to go up this way and we want to head in here. All right. Let's go ahead and head deep into the tunnel into, of uh, the depths of Angel Tower. And see what we can see. All right. And we've got a new enemy here, the Phantom. Now, we want to start by taking out the Spectres first, because they can drain your MP. Because of this depressed spell. And unfortunately, it looks like they're going to get some of my AP there. Yeah, I got almost all of it from Dark. Oh well. Now watch out for these things, because they can cast instant death. And it worked. Hey, alright, and Ryu recovers with his willpower. It's just like the previous games, if you've got enough guts. You can um, you can recover, so that's pretty cool. And of course, he's gonna hit Ryu again. Damn it! Probably should have healed, but I thought I could survive. Oh well, no big deal. Ryu's uh, got enough levels that we're uh, in good shape, anyways. But yeah, we should probably heal after after that one. Uh, and it doesn't really matter who you get to heal. Um, okay, very good. Now, see so you notice we have a crack in the wall. Now, fortunately, we have someone that can deal with that. So Momo just opens it and fire! All right, let's go down this way and out here. Then we want to go down this way. And just some tricksters there, no problem. And we get a diamond ring and some moon tears. Excellent. I don't know why the moon is crying. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me, but nonetheless. Yeah, so it restores HP and status, which is really good. I really like that. Okay, so let's see uh, what this diamond ring can do here. So let's equip that. I usually go with Ryu. And protection, ooh, versus instant death. That's going to be useful. Uh, yeah, so let's definitely throw that on Ryu there. And now, we'll go against instant death. Very good. Now let's go this way. And we want to head, let's see, out this way, and down here. And I'll go against some new enemies here, the Cerberus, or Cerebus, I guess it's in this game. I don't know if it's still pronounced Cerberus, but nonetheless. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, let's try this new flame attack that we got. I don't think Ryu can do anything with that. But you know, he's got a Quake attack, so let's try that. And Gar, you just attack. Let's just try putting these things to use. Ooh, didn't even get a, a weird sound there. Eh, not bad. Whoa! Well, I'm not quite sure what that did. I think it just causes some distortion there. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what that ability does. Uh, here we go. Alright. There we go. Good job, team. Very good. Very well done. I didn't get as much experience as I wanted to, but I know we got some beef jerky. Which I'm guessing uh, I'm guessing that just restores your HP. Let's uh, take a look. Down there. Oops. Uh, where's my beef jerky? Uh, oh, just restore some beef. Okay, very good. All right, so let's head down this way. And let's see, we want to go down here. And up here. And under here. And down this way. All right, now let's see. Now we want to head this way, 
And now we've got this giant block here. Now, believe it or not, Gar can actually push it. That's exactly what we want to do. We want to have him just mosey this block this way here. Me, Gar. Me, big, strong guardian. Well, I was going to say strong man, but he isn't really a strong man. He's just kind of a strong guy there. Okay. Now what we want to do is once, once it's there, we want to push it up this way. Yeah. Now the block is locked into place. Excellent. All right. Now we want to go this way. And... Here. Okay. Now we want to go this way. And let's see. Uh, through here. And then up here. And then up this way. There we go. Okay. Now... Now we want to go this way. And if I've done this correctly... Oh, well, what the hell? Oh, I needed to push it all the way in. Crap. I think if you push it all the way in, you can uh, make your way across the platform. So um, let me uh, do that again real quick, and I'll be right back, because I messed that up. Okay, there we go. You've got to set the block uh, right in between those two squares. And if you manage to mess this up, you can actually push the block all the way into that little crevice there, and the box will explode. Then you just go in a door and go out again, and then you try it again. But for getting this right, we can walk right across. And get into a random battle here. By the way, um, these Cerberuses go down pretty quickly uh, with Ryu's uh, attack there. Plus, you almost always get a beef jerky from them, which is nice. And if we go over here, we get the Mithril Helm. Excellent. So let's equip that on Ryu, of course. Yeah, good increase in defense for him there. Uh, so we definitely want to uh, get that going with him. Uh, let's see. What else can I do to increase his... Oh, it's probably that armor there. Uh, let's see, with him, defensive two, but losing nine, nah. That's, uh, that's for the armor there, but I want to keep that asbestos armor defense. Very good. I'm going to heal. I want to do that there. Okay, let's get see what's normal this time. Uh, okay, very good. All right, very nice. Now we need to make our way back down to that door. So let's just do that real quick, and we just go across here. And then over here, and then we're basically just backtracking. By the way, um, I've received several comments, uh, messages saying that they couldn't wait to see what happens with, with the next episode. And the only time I ever really see that, one of the only times I ever really saw that was when I ended with a naked woman at the end. So there's that. <laughs> oh man, that's fun. Okay, now we want to go up here. So there's a lot of dead ends here, so we just want to avoid those and just keep working our way all the way through. All right. Now we go over here and we get, ooh, a soul gem. Nice. All right, so now let's head back. Now that we have our treasure, let's go back out this way. And we know we want to go down these stairs. Go. All right. Okay, cool. Now here is where we got a little bit of a puzzle to solve. All right, now, here's where we get to have a little bit of fun. Okay, now what we want to do, let's see here, is we want to go here. Aha, now we're going to have to do a lot of pushing of, um, kind of pushing of these different kind of blocks here. Okay, so now, as you can tell, we're going to have to do some, uh, some uh, puzzle solving here. Now, but unfortunately, okay, now we want to do just that right there. Um, now we want. Now you don't want to push some of these blocks too far because if you do, uh, you'll end up destroying them, and that's no good. Okay. Now let's go back up this way. And now we don't want to exit up, otherwise everything will restart. So now we want to go this way and over here. And down here. And now we got to push this black. Uh, this. Uh, platform this way here. Now, now, don't push it too far, because if we do that, uh, if you push it too far, unfortunately, you'll you'll blow up the platform, and we don't want to do that. 
Okay. Now what we want to do is swap out like this. Uh, let's see. Yeah, now we want to go here. Let's see. Oops. Who's in the lead? I need Gar to be in the lead. There we go. And push the block this way. And I believe that's it. Now again, you don't want to do that. Because if you push too far, you'll you'll crush everything, and we don't want to do that. Uh, okay. Now let's go here and down this way. And over here. And then up here. And if I've done this correctly. Hopefully I have. Then this should line right up into place. Aha! Now I can go up this way. And over here. And over here. And I've done it! Yay! And we get into level for Gar there. And his HP rose, and his power rose, and his defense rose. Which is the only stats that I care about. So, very good. All right, let's head down here. Let's keep right on moving. Hmm. I'm not really moving the characters, huh? Oh. Uh, okay. Sure. All right. Well, I hope Momo can make his way out of the cave by himself. Okay. That's kind of weird. Hmm. Guardian Gase. 234. Kind of interesting. What do we have here? Guardian Gaw. 198. It's kind of very interesting. What would all these different guardians mean? It's kind of strange. What do we have here? Ah, Guardian Gar. 299. Huh. Uh-huh. Yes. But Dragon Slayers? What the hell? What do you mean, Dragon Slayers? The hell are you talking about, Gar? Wait. Uh huh. He killed a bunch of dragons in the war. What the hell? Whoa! Is this like my people or something? Whoa! Uh-huh. Okay. What what did happen to the brood? Uh-huh. Yes. What why did they do that? Well, I guess so. Oh, I see. Okay. This is um, this is just kind of you know a lot to take in. So it sounds like Gar defeated my people. Gar, why is your weapon raised? <gasps> Wait, what are you doing? No, no, there's no way. Gar brought us here to fight us? Oh my God! What the hell? It, it, now it's time for a boss battle against Gar? What the hell? I, what kind of a swerve is this? Well, I, I guess now I gotta fight Gar? Uh, okay. Well, I... Uh, I, I, I guess. Well, let's raise our... Section, I guess. So we can raise our defense, but... Wow. Ow. By the way, don't even worry about turning into a dragon in this. You should have more than enough uh, strength to take to to survive everything. But uh, if things, if if you feel like you can't hang, just uh, just cast the healing. Just heal yourself up, and everything should be okay. Uh, and besides, you want to save your AP for uh, healing spells. But what the hell? This is a gigantic swerve. Like, like this is like a heel turn. 
Like, this is nothing short of a heel turn. Ow! But yeah, as you can see, Gar, when you're, when you're going against him, he doesn't do a whole lot of damage to you. But, uh... So just be careful that... That Ryu can, uh... That he can, uh... Turn his back on you, but my goodness! This is just nuts! There you go. Good shot there. If you want to heal up after that one. Again, fortunately, you can heal. Uh, uh, I guess fortunately that your, your healing spells will uh, will uh, take precedence there over the over the over the turns there. But as you can see, I've done way more damage to Gar than the amount of HP he's had. So. Obviously, his current number of HP has no effect on on this battle here. But holy cow! Like, like Gar was our friend, and he, he 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 saved us from from Balio and Sunder, and and he, he didn't just let us die in the battle. You know, he didn't just let have Balio and Sunder kill us. But I guess this kind of makes sense now with him talking about the boss being displeased and you know why he decided to stab Balio and Sunder in the back. I guess they're all working for the same people. Got him! Yeah, we did. And we defeated a backstabbing bastard also. Serves you right, you little son of a bitch. Uh-huh. Well, yeah, but I mean, are wait, are we the bad guys now? Now what? Whoa! Whoa! Why did the light stop? Uh oh! Is that one of my people? Um, because I want you to. Whoa! Huh? What the hell is going on? You? <gasps> Whoa! Kaiser? Uh-oh. What, where are we going? Uh-oh. 